Okay, so today I wanted to film um, Riley's new room tour. Um, just this past, like, it's almost been like actually a month now. Um, we bought her all new furniture because we needed her crib for baby brother and she just needed new stuff. So I went ahead and we finally bought her a bunch of new furniture. We got it from Ashley's. Um, and we completely redid her room. So this is her new big girl room. Okay, so this is her room tour. This is what you see when you first come into her room. Um, we've got, well, I'll just do an overview really quick first. So this is an overview of her room. Over here, she's got a closet. And that's where I was just standing. And over here. Ah, da, 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 da. Okay, so when you first come into her room, over to the right, she's got her little shopping cart. Some just knickknacks, like a little um, threading toy and a another toy. Um, right now she has a picture of her and her papa hanging up here. That's where she wanted that this year. Um, and then she also has her Barbie dream house over here. This was really hard to figure out where to put just because it's so, it's huge. <laughs> um, but this is where we decided to put it. And then next to it we have her dresser. Um, on top of her dresser, we have some of her decor that actually we haven't been able to take out in, like, years. This is decor from her, like, first nursery, like, way back when she was a baby baby. So we've got a little bowl, some seashells, and I just shoved some lights in there <laughs> just because I didn't know what to do with the lights. We have this up here with our, our second baby that we adopted. <laughs> um, no, I'm just kidding, but this still hasn't been filled out, and she's three years old, so... I'm hoping if I put it up that it will remind me to do that. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> then I also have just a little seashell thing here. Her um, nursery was coastal themed. So now we've got this little tray that I don't really know what to do with. Right now it just has some candles on it. Um, her missing doorknob. <laughs> um, a little reindeer. Got this little cute thing. I think most of this decor came from Kohl's like a long time ago or Pier 1. Um, a little light thingy. This is Christmas decor. I don't know. I don't really know what I'm going to do with the decor after Christmas because some of it's going to move. And then we just have like a string of lights right now because she wanted them in her room. I really like this dresser. Um, okay, so I'm going to go through her dresser really quick too just to share. Um, so in this one... We don't really have anything. I have this that I still need to hang up and find a spot to hang up. Um, in this drawer, nothing. In this bottom drawer, we have her socks and panties and like tights and then all of her jeans. Yep. Say I'm wearing a swimsuit for some reason. I don't know why. And then over here, in this top drawer, we have a bunch of mittens. Um, hats, mittens, scarves, we've got, um, um, she has like a bunch of princess crowns in here, some sand toys for when we go down to the beach, this is like a beach towel, I think her swimsuit was in there until she decided she wanted to wear it today. <laughs> um, in this drawer I have some extra blankets, I have a stack of clothes that I am waiting to decide what to do with. I think I'm going to try to sell most of those. They're too small for her. Um, and then in this bottom drawer, we have all of her pajamas. And that's it. So I still have a completely empty drawer right here. And this one was completely empty once I hang that up. So I've got lots of room. Um, yeah, that's her drawer and her dresser. I really like this dresser. It's really cute. Okay, moving on. We have her um, little reading area right here. So she's got her little chair and some a bucket with some books in it. Right now it has a bunch of Christmas books in it. Um, but we change that out every so often. And then over next to that, we've got her bed. Um, her bed is a full-size bed. So bigger than a twin, but not quite as big as a queen. Um, this is what I mean by some of the decor needs to be changed. That looks so awkward there. I really need to change that. Um, her bedding, I think, is from Target, I believe. Yeah, it's just the kids' collection at Target. And then underneath her bed, we decided to use some of this as storage. And I really like the fact that it's so big under here. I have lots of room for storage under here. 
So we just have some of her little people stuff over there, her little people farm, and toys under there. And then on this side is stuff for her Barbies. So we got her Barbies in this one. Um, I think like Barbie accessories in that one, and then Barbie clothes in that one. And then if you look way back there, you can reach it from um, that side over there. They, we have some backpacks stored under there that she likes to play with or that we use when we go up to Ohio or whatever. Um, but yeah, this is her bed. I really like the bed. We got the matching set between the bed and the dresser. They just, they go together. Um, she also has this little blanket and this unicorn stuffed animal that she likes to sleep with. I don't know where those came from because my mom got them for her, so I have no idea. Um, and then over here, we've got her stroller and her baby high chair slash swing slash um i think like a car seat carrier that's like a little that's one of the, the little collections that they have at target i don't really know this used to be in her closet and i just i really don't like it here but i can't find i can't seem to come up with a better spot for it um if it collapsed i could possibly put it under there but it doesn't collapse so i have no idea um, and then over here we've got her closet. So there's in relationship to like where everything else is. Um, okay, the, her closet's like the main part that took forever to organize. So when we open her closet, this is what it looks like. I'll do a little overview. Um, <laughs> it looks absolutely insane now that I'm looking at it on the camera. Um, Alright, so we'll start up here. Way up at the top on this top shelf, we have all of her stuffed animals um, that I just didn't know what to do with. They used to be on top of her dresser when she had her old dresser in here, but it's just, they they take over the dresser and <laughs> there's like, it just, it, it looks messy. So at least this way the mess is like contained into a closet, I guess. So there's all her stuffed animals. Over here we have some toys that are either too young for her or too old for her. I think one of them is like a Mickey Mouse like um, shoelace thing that she can't quite do yet. And then other ones are like big chunky puzzles that are too easy for her. But we don't want to get rid of them. We're just saving them for baby brother. And then in this box over here, it is full to the rim as you can see. Overflowing. That has um, just a bunch of books in it. We take that down and we swap out the books that are in there. Um, probably like... Every other month or so, when she gets bored of them, we'll just swap them around. And then on um, the shelves, I mean, on, yeah, under, on underneath the shelf, on the hangers, we have her clothes. So this is just mainly her jackets, long sleeve stuff, stuff to keep her warm, some shirts, no particular order really, um, some extra hangers. And then over here we have her all of her like dress up stuff. So. She's got princess dresses, mermaid dresses, she's got this big giant um, unicorn outfit that she likes to wear. And then on top of her um, kitchen, we have more stuffed animals. These are the stuffed animals that she like really likes to play with or she'll like to cuddle with or that she just like in general uses more. Like she'll ask for these ones. So we have them lower so that she can actually reach them if she wants them. And she doesn't have to ask us for anything that's up there. Um, so yeah, we have her kitchen here. Over in that little corner where we have some of her dolls. These are like, I don't even know what kind of dolls they are. They're just dolls. I don't, like, I don't even know. I, they're not little people. They're not, I don't know. I have no idea. They're dolls that uh, Jake's mom got for her, though. So she likes playing with them. Um, and then we have over on this corner her babies and baby accessories and everything. This thing is just full to the absolute rim with bottles and potties and babies and honestly, who knows what else. Um, I tried to cycle through some of this and purge some of it, but honestly, she plays with every single baby in there. There's not a single baby in there that she neglects or like hasn't played with in the past like week. She plays with all of her babies. She loves all of her babies. <laughs> so we didn't, although I'd love to purge that, we, we didn't. <laughs> um, and then right in front of here, we have her medical set thing that just has all of her doctor kit stuff in it. She loves to play doctor. And then this, 
we have a basket for her dirty clothes, um, some shoes that she's kind of actually outgrowing. I don't really know. And then in here, she's got these little annoying pet thingies. I Don't ask me. Um, and then in the drawers, this top drawer has her ice cream set along with her pizza set and her cash register. She'll pull this stuff out and play um, shop or set up shop or whatever. She'll say she's open for business and she'll sell ice cream or pizza or what have you. Um, and this drawer is all of her, this is basically her art drawer. It's got a bunch of um, coloring books and papers. Um, this has crayons in it. That one has markers. That's a big roll of paper that we roll out if she wants to paint. And then, yeah, a bunch of paints and glitter and just basically just arts and craft supplies in there. And then down in this bottom drawer is where we decided to keep her Play-Doh stuff. So, um, she had more, but she's not really good at keeping Play-Doh in the container so it dries out and we go through it really fast. Um, <laughs> so yeah. That's pretty much her closet. And I think that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, that was really a hard thing to figure out how to do because we had this out and we had that in the living room and it just, it didn't work out. It just wasn't, it wasn't working for me. <laughs> so to be able to figure out how we were gonna do this closet took forever. And I like, I just, I like the way I have it set up because we also had to be mindful of this little area because we couldn't have anything too close to that because this door sticks out. Uh, it was just, it was a big pain to figure out how to set up all of this, but I'm pretty happy with the results. But yeah, I think that's it. Um, if anyone has any questions about like anything or where I got anything, I think I tried to cover most of it. Um, I'll answer them, but yeah, that's pretty much it. I'm pretty happy with how it came out. Like I said, I just gotta do, redo the uh, wall decor so that it makes a bit more sense. That might take a minute though. I don't know when I'll ever get that done. Um, but yeah, anyway, thanks so much for watching.